Technological revolution. The robot with a human brain. That's transforming artificial intelligence. Do you remember the science fiction movies where robots were both allies and adversaries? Today, reality is advancing beyond fiction. A team of scientists has developed a robot with a partially biological brain. Imagine a machine that not only learns and adapts, but might even have human-like experiences. In this video, I'll present the details of this groundbreaking advancement. Also, stay tuned until the end to learn about another piece of news that, while surprising, is equally fascinating and worth your attention. Yes, you heard correctly, we're talking about a robot with a brain made of biological cells. This achievement has crossed a frontier that many thought was unreachable, redefining the very essence of artificial intelligence. Scientists have named this innovation Brain on a Chip. Instead of using traditional computer circuits, researchers have cultivated brain cells in a laboratory and placed them on a microchip with surgical precision. They have transplanted the essence of human cognition into a machine, marking the beginning of a new era of intelligent machines. Before we continue, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell if you haven't done so yet. Let's continue. What's most impressive is that these complex networks of neurons firing and connecting somehow mimic our own brains. Scientists have managed to recreate this neural network on a tiny chip, capturing the essence of human cognition. This process starts with stem cells, which have the ability to transform into almost any type of cell in the human body. Using these stem cells, scientists have created a network of brain cells that emulates the functioning of a human brain. They have then integrated this neural network into a special microchip, creating a robot brain that not only simulates thought, but also can adapt and learn from new experiences, coming closer to human intelligence. The significance of this advancement lies in the fact that this robot can learn and adapt like a living creature. It does not follow a set of pre-programmed instructions. It experiences and changes based on what it learns, developing new skills and responses with each interaction. This ability for self-learning and adaptation brings it much closer to the functioning of a human brain than any other AI developed so far, offering revolutionary potential in the evolution of artificial intelligence. The implications of all this are enormous. This development could revolutionize our understanding of the brain and artificial intelligence. By studying these lab-grown brain networks, we could discover new ways to treat neurological diseases such as Alzheimer's or Parkinson's, as well as offer new insights into brain function. The ability of these biological brains on microchips to replicate human cognitive processes opens doors to innovative therapies and a deeper understanding of brain functions. This is not just an impressive technological advance, it has the potential to change lives, improve medical treatments, and transform the field of neuroscience. However, this advancement also raises serious ethical questions. We are venturing into unknown territory where the boundaries between life and machine become blurred. At what point does a robot with a biological brain become something alive or even conscious? This question is no longer just a philosophical issue, but a real ethical dilemma that may need to be addressed in the near future. The implications of endowing machines with characteristics so close to human life compel us to reflect on their impact on society. How will we regulate the use of this technology? What rights, if any, should these robots have? Although this development is still in its early stages, it is crucial to start discussing these issues to anticipate and manage potential ethical challenges that might arise. This dialogue is essential to ensure that technological advancement aligns with human values and does not create more problems than it solves. In other news, 
Jeff Bezos and SoftBank have invested $300 million in a startup called Special AI. This company is not trying to put lab-grown human brains into robots. Instead, they are building an artificial brain from scratch. Their goal is to develop a general-purpose artificial brain that can be installed in any robot, allowing it to perform complex tasks without specific programming. Special AI, led by experts from Carnegie Mellon, aims to create robots capable of handling adverse physical conditions and performing routine manipulations in industrial and domestic environments. They are progressing towards the development of General Artificial Intelligence AGI, aspiring to achieve human-like intelligence in robots. If you're enjoying the content, remember to like and subscribe. You would help us a lot. In India, there are also significant advancements in robotics. Zen Technologies and AI Turing Technologies have created a four-legged robot named Prahasta, inspired by a warrior from Hindu mythology. This robot is designed for defense and is equipped with LIDAR technology and AI to scan its surroundings and plan missions. Prahasta can climb stairs, jump over obstacles, and lift an adult human, which could be useful in dangerous situations. Imagine a robot capable of navigating complex terrains and rescuing people in the midst of natural disasters or even in combat zones where human access would be extremely hazardous. Prahasta's versatility makes it an invaluable tool not only for defense, but also for rescue missions and humanitarian aid. Furthermore, Prahasta is not the only impressive advancement in robotics in India. Zen Technologies has also unveiled the Barbarian URCWS, a remote-controlled weapon station that can be used both on land and at sea. This technology allows operators to control the weapons from a safe location, minimizing the risk to soldiers on the battlefield. The station's ability to operate in different environments makes it extremely adaptable and useful in various situations, from defending coastal installations to protecting ground bases. These advancements in robotics not only represent impressive technological innovations, but also raise important ethical questions. How much autonomy should armed robots have? Should they be capable of making life or death decisions without human intervention? What are the ethical implications of using AI in defense? These are questions that society will need to address as this technology continues to advance. The possibility of armed robots operating autonomously without direct human oversight raises concerns about control and responsibility in conflict situations. In the context of defense and security, the use of autonomous robots presents significant ethical dilemmas. Autonomy in armed robots could reduce the risk to human soldiers, but could also lead to situations where robots make fatal decisions without a complete understanding of the human context. This balance between protecting human lives and technological autonomy is a debate that will need to be resolved with care and consideration. As robotics and artificial intelligence continue to evolve, it is crucial that regulatory and ethical frameworks are developed to guide the responsible use of these technologies. The international community will need to collaborate to establish standards and guidelines to ensure that the use of armed robots complies with the principles of international humanitarian law and human rights. This includes ensuring that any decision made by an armed robot is reviewable and that final responsibility rests with trained human operators. In conclusion, recent developments in artificial intelligence and robotics are pushing the boundaries of what is possible, creating new opportunities and presenting new challenges. Technological innovation is changing the world at an unprecedented pace, and it is crucial to consider the ethical implications of these advances to ensure a future where technology is used responsibly and beneficially for humanity. Collaboration among scientists, legislators and society at large will be essential to navigate the challenges 
and maximize the benefits of these emerging technologies. What do you think about creating robots with biological brains? Do you believe they should have rights similar to humans? Leave us your opinion in the comments. If you like the content, don't forget to like and share it. Your support is greatly appreciated and helps us continue to share interesting information. Thank you.